Hello and welcome to my Podia review where I'm going to be giving you a Podia platform demo and of course going over some of the biggest features as well as giving you an overview about how they work. Now if you'd like to follow along, a great thing about Podia right off the bat is they do come with a free plan. So if you click the link down below in the description, you can do that and of course follow along or just test them out yourself. I've been doing plenty of tutorial videos for Podia and what I did is get a free plan myself. I went through just about most of the biggest features and what I did is just delete all the products and everything so I can show you how to pretty much start from scratch to give you a better idea of how they work. Just in the beginning, going to give you a features tour here. If you look at the top, you're going to see some of the biggest features themselves. So we have our site where we can view and edit. Obviously, nothing's going to be there when I deleted everything. But as you go along, I'll show you how that works. We have our products, and that's going to be the first thing I talk about, the different types of products. And of course, creating more of a course or membership site. Communities are great. You can consider this a Facebook group alternative. So you don't have to keep all of your students or community off of a platform. You can do everything in one spot. Email is going to be for broadcasts and campaigns. And of course, we have some audience stuff and of course, sales if you want to increase your sales, coupons and so on and so forth. With all that being said, let's talk about the Podia products first. So, so let's click on this and do new product. As you can see here, there are going to be multiple types of products that you can choose from. First and foremost is going to be the most popular one, which is an online course. You can create a series of lessons with files, posts, and quizzes. That's what I'm going to be talking about. There is the option for digital downloads. And the cool thing about that, you can actually create lead generation pages where you offer something for free. They opt in, they get an email, they download it, and you have the email from there. There's webinars. We can sell access to a Zoom or YouTube webinar. There's bundles for selling a collection of other products for a new price and coaching sessions, which is cool. You can integrate with some calendar apps and go from there, whether you want to do that separately or you can add that to one of the lessons or courses that you have. It's a nice little touch. For this, let's talk about the memberships area, which is also going to be for online courses. I'm going to give this a title and then click on create product. All right, so we have the affiliate blueprint and click on create product. All right, so the cool thing about this is that Something I'm probably going to bring up multiple times, given that this is a review. Overall, Podia really strives on simplicity. And because of that, I have a feeling you're not going to have a whole lot of difficulty getting up and running. For example, if we're creating a membership for this course, the first thing we want to do is create a new section. In this, I am going to call it the introduction. Okay. Introduction blurb. This is going to be where you talk about what's going to be in the specific section. So, under sections, there's going to be lessons. All right. So, this is just like the main heading for it. And what's also cool is that you can drip feed anything if you want, but we're going to keep this as available immediately and save. Okay. So, that's going to be the introduction. And of course, we want lessons under that. I'm just going to create one more section to do, show you how we do two of them here. Okay, I'm just going to add this in. Obviously, you would add a description and we have our second one. So now what we can do, obviously, if we're going to have more sections, we would continue on with that. But let's say we want to add a new lesson. Here's where you can utilize adding text, adding embeds, add quizzes, add coaching, and of course, files. Now, if you're curious about how you can add videos, all you need to do is do it in the add file section. So allow me to do that. Okay, so after that, all it does is go straight to where you can upload your video. I'm going to do the same thing with a few more lessons in the second section. So we have a new lesson and add files. Okay, and let's give those a second to render and load. And once they're done, I will be right back, which is going to be very quickly. Okay, so now that those are done, allow me to quickly show you how you can add another lesson. For example, if you want to utilize coaching, you can do a quiz and better text. Let's just go with text and I'll show you how that works. Okay, let's just call this the biggest takeaways. And this is going to be something where instead of having a video, you're going to have all of your text in this box. Okay, whatever that's going to be. I'm not going to take time just to write that out. And of course, this can be utilized whether it's visible or hidden. And again, store preview. This is cool because if you have a specific lesson that's a really powerful one, and maybe you want to highlight it when you're creating your website so that future students can preview it. This is going to be the preview uh, aspect right here, but I'm just going to keep disabled here and let's click on save. All right. And since all of these have been loaded, I'm just going to show you very quickly what it looks like. So for view lesson we have here, uh, give me one second and we can listen to myself. Hey, it's James Canzanella and thank you so much for Perfect. Okay. So there you have it. And it looks pretty simple. I love the, the cleanness of it. Obviously, there's nothing fancy going around here. But like I talked about, I think the simplicity is going to be one of the biggest perks of using Podia, especially for the fact that if you have your files, you know what you're talking about. It's going to be a very quick process for getting up and running. And of course, you can repeat these steps when it comes to adding more sections, more lessons. And of course, maybe you want to add some quizzes or anything else. All the fine details in terms of the pricing, uh, details and availability can be edited up there up top. Overall, I think that's a good showcase of the Podia membership site, or if you're just looking to create courses, especially for the simplicity that I just can't highlight enough. 
Next, let's quickly talk about the Podia community section. This is another great aspect because it allows you to utilize a community on the same platform instead of going off to say like Discord or Facebook where there's just so many distractions. Let's hop on over to the community. I already have one here. I deleted all the posts, but I'm just gonna click on home. And communities are great, very easy to set up. And the first thing you'd probably wanna do with that is go with the topics here. So right off the bat, I believe there's gonna be a general topic. So think of it kind of like a forum. Anytime someone posts something, they can kind of categorize it into which topic is going to be the best. So if we talk about something software related, we're probably gonna have a topic for that. If we talk about something, say YouTube related, there'll be a separate topic for that. Allow me to show you how to quickly create one. So we go to new topic. Okay, so we have our name is YouTube and let's talk about YouTube. And what's, and what's cool is very quickly, instead of, you know, if you didn't wanna choose your own image, you can search for it using Unsplash. So let's do YouTube and anything related to that, you know, looks fine. Say something like this. Of course, this is going to be open. Anyone with access, uh, notifications, you know, these are going to be up to you, but let's keep it public. Let's create topic right there. Okay, so that's what it's going to look like. So we have our, all our topics here. And of course, when you know what you're going to be talking about within your community, you want to make sure you create uh, topics that are going to be based upon your most specific topics, kind of like I mentioned previously. Okay, there's going to be a members section here where you can search who's going to be in there and so on and so forth. You have the fine tuned settings, but let's go back over home. And let's say we want to create a new post. I'll give you an example. Okay, we have YouTube suggestions and down below. Do you have any suggestions for a new YouTube channel? This is where they choose the topic, of course. And let's just do done and publish now. Okay, let's say we like that. Of course, reply, you know, say, uh, I do, you know, whatever the post is going to be just to kind of show you an example. And if we go home here, we can kind of reload this and you're going to see how posts will stack up this way. So once again, a great way to kind of replace the Facebook groups. This is something I really like about Podia uh, simply because I'm not on Facebook a lot. I think it's just such a huge time waster, especially for the fact that I think groups now have a lot of advertisings in them. Plus you get all the people uh, messaging others, you know, to just like spam them. It's a nightmare sometimes. So this is a great little feature that comes along with Podia. Speaking of great features, we also have the ability to utilize websites. So another great thing about Podia is that not only do they have the free plan, but you get the website with the free plan, which is pretty cool if you ask me. Let's talk about that a little. So here we are, a very plain and basic website. And the cool thing about this, once again, a very simple process. Anytime we want to add something, we're going to hover over it and click on the plus little button right here. And if you look at the side here, you're going to see some of the main things that we can utilize. We have bios, email forms, text, images, featured, grid, links, FAQs, testimonials, categories, and plans. So let's say we wanted to click on text here. You're going to see that we can utilize our text, something right here. There's going to be other aspects that we can change around it with how it looks. You can choose image or search for images if you want a background and so on and so forth. And say you don't like something like that, you can always remove it just like this. Right, so let's say we want to add something at the top that's going to be just a grid, right? So there's multiple things that we can utilize here. You can see this is going to be our title. So like, welcome to Marketing Island. And something like, we help you with dot, dot, dot. And of course, under that, we have our items. So this is going to be item one, item two, item three. Of course, you can add more items. You can delete them. But let's say we want to change around the first one. We help you with, you know, software. And then we have our blurb about software. We can carry on and do similar with this, okay? That's going to be the process for adding, say, a specific section where we can have, excuse me, a grid with multiple sections and so on and so forth. There's much more we can do than that. Obviously, let's say we have images here. So I'm going to upload an image of me. Right, so there's the image of me, and we're like, wow, that is way too big. And I agree. So what we can do is just make the width a little bit smaller, something like that. And so for our image, this is the title, meet your instructor. The dude loves software. Okay, obviously put something a little bit better than that. We're just showing you an example here. Okay, so that would be something like that. What else can we utilize very quickly? Let's go back over here and let's say, let's go one down right here. Actually, let's go right here. 
And what we can do is featured. So we did create a product and we also have a community. So depending on what you want to advertise here on your website, it's great because it's already hooked up within all this platform. Let's say we want to talk about our community here. It can be right here. We can obviously change this around. We can choose image. We can search image. Let's say we want to do, you know, something software related. Doesn't always have to be the island. Let's go with this one. Looks so much better, right? Custom name. We have the software community. Of course, obviously that would probably be the name if that's what we were gonna utilize before. We have our join now, we have our preview. And overall, this is kind of giving you an idea of the simplicity of utilizing this. Something I do wanna talk about, and I'll probably mention at the end, but just in case I forget, is once again, if you, in case you haven't heard it enough times, it seems like Podio really anchors themselves in the power of simplicity, which is something I personally love, but for a few people out there, it's not as advanced. And I know sometimes everyone wants those like little advanced features where you can do so much more with a drag and drop editor or a builder, but I think this is gonna be plenty enough. This is gonna be great for getting you up and running. And I think if you're really looking to get your course or website up very quickly, that's gonna be something that's very helpful for you. What's also great about Podia is the fact that they come with hosting. Something I wanna quickly talk about is that you don't need to get separate hosting. The fact that you utilize Podia, you're gonna be on their platform. So whether it's gonna be utilizing their websites, their courses or memberships or whatever it may be, that's something you don't have to get separately. So that's one big benefit that I quickly wanted to mention as well in case you had that specific question. Nevertheless, I'm just gonna click on done or publish here. Let's talk about one more feature now, let's go back. All right, so we have our emails. First and foremost are gonna be the broadcast. A broadcast is very similar to a newsletter. Anytime you wanna send out an email to anyone, you can do that. So let's click on send broadcast. All right, we have our subject. You need to see this, okay? This is going to be our email here. You can always preview it. You can always send a test, which will work with the email that you use to sign up for Podia in case you were curious. Attachments, if are going to be needed, you can always finish later. You can send later. You can review and send. That's gonna be up to you. But overall, it's a very clean and basic setup for your email marketing. But I think something that's gonna be even more valuable are gonna be the email campaigns. Let's click on that and I'll show you. All right, so I'm gonna call this the Marketing Island Follow-Ups. Keep in mind that this specific name is only something that you're going to see. This isn't going to be, say, like a subject line. It's just for you and what you need to know. So there's also gonna be the entrance condition. This means how are how is someone going to be able to see these campaigns? What you can do is based on if they sign up for a product, subscribe for waitlist emails, joined a community plan or tagged with. We created a community. So let's just say that if someone went through that, we would choose if they did the marketing island one that we talk about, all plans. Okay, so this is how they can actually get that. Now what we would do is go through and utilize all our emails. So right off the bat, obviously the first email is going to get sent immediately. So your email is here and we'll do like, you know, congrats, you know, thanks for opting in. That wouldn't be the official subject line, but just as an example, of course we can save that and we can make it active too. So if we wanna start our campaign, we can. However, another great thing about this is that we can utilize another email right here. So the first one goes out zero days and now we can choose how many more days do we wanna send this after the entrance. So let's say it's two days. Okay, our email subject line is gonna be, have you seen this software? Of course, your email is going to be here. And you can just keep repeating the same process when it comes to creating more emails. The idea here is that it's going to be automated, kind of like an autoresponder. So once they opt in, they're gonna get this. Then of course, two days later is gonna be this one. And of course, say we wanna do another email, keep in mind it's gonna be days after the entrance, not days after the previous email. So let's say this is gonna be seven days, all right? So the first one is gonna be immediately then two days later from that, and then this is gonna be seven days from them opting in, okay? And you can just keep repeating the process over and over. You can finish later, you can start campaign. It's a nice little touch knowing that you can also generate leads, you know, get your email list on this, and also send out broadcasts and campaigns using their email marketing platform. All right, so Podia definitely has a lot to offer. Now let's take a quick look at their pricing. We talked about the free plan. There are gonna be some limitations and of course it's gonna be certainly worth upgrading if you're gonna be doing more transactions overall and if you want some of the better perks. These aren't gonna be all of them, but I'll just kind of compare these right here just to save some time. Of course, you can always check that out yourself using the link down below. With free, there's gonna be 8% fees. You get the full website, you get email marketing, community, but it'll just be one download, one coaching product, draft courses, and draft webinars. 
webinars. So once you're actually to start selling those, you're going to want to upgrade for that specific feature. You don't get chat support, affiliates, or third-party code. As you move up, you get no transaction fees. So for you, maybe you specifically or someone else, I know there's going to be a lot of people that once you start selling more, it's going to make more sense to move up to mover just because the fees alone will pretty much cover it, if you know what I mean. So Still with this, you're getting full website, email marketing, community, but this you get unlimited downloads, unlimited coaching, unlimited courses. You can draft webinars and of course chat support. And as you can see right here for the shaker is going to be 89 a month. You're going to see how they change. You get some of the best perks and even more like the chat support affiliates and third party code. So overall, concluding my Podia review, what I have to say about it is that they are a fantastic software platform, creating courses slash memberships, adding coaches, generating leads. You can even run webinars on them. And of course, the free website platform and something that I noticed all throughout doing every single tutorial is the power of simplicity with Podia. With that, you might lack some of the most advanced features that you might find elsewhere. But as I've been talking about all throughout, your ability to get up and running and remove a lot of that frustration that can come with first using a software that's going to be a great thing like when i first started testing this right out of the box i didn't have really any problems getting up and running and i think you can see that when i was showcasing this of course while this wouldn't be like the final community group that i created i might make a few more touches here and here but just to get it up and running especially your website and the courses by adding your sections lessons and of course all the appropriate content is a pretty easy process and with that i think you're really going to like podia if you love simplicity also, if you love having a community all under one roof where you're selling your courses or your coaching, that's another big bonus. So do check out Podia, especially for the fact that they do come with that free plan. And they're very generous when it comes to a lot of the features that are included in that free plan. And of course, once you want some of the best and better features, you can upgrade as needed to even help you save on transaction fees, which is a good thing. I will keep that link down below in case you want to test them out. My name is James. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. And thank you so much for watching my review, and I'll see you in my next video.